Welcome back to BlyleDev. This is Bo again. I'm bringing you guys some quick videos to really quick answers. Um, this is another one that I struggled to find on YouTube and I actually I found a lot of people who spoke awful English and I finally figured out how to how to do this. I'm going to show you guys how to make your background, a UI image view, instead of making an image, make it an animated image, making it a GIF instead. And we're going to actually pull in um, a file from online in order to do that. It's really easy. I'm going to show you guys how to do it today. Um, if you go over here to my view controller, I've already set up this image. I've already made it an outlet called BG. It's a UI image view. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go online and we're going to be getting to this page, but to show you guys how to get here, um, you're just going to type in GIF Bahlo. That's the name of the user on GitHub that's made this file. And so if you just want to click that, that first link should take you to this a small UI image extension for GIF support. We're going to want to go down to Swift GIF Common. Click this, UI image plus gif.swift. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take this whole thing, copy it, go to your project, click new file, make it a Swift file, and let's just call this gif to uh, image. Perfect. I'm actually going to just get rid of this here. I'm going to just paste in all that code. Um, I'm going to leave this copy right up here for this user. Um, not that we can't use it, we can. Uh, it is a public file that he's allowed anyone to use, which is really awesome, nice of him. Um, but we're now going to go into our view controller. Oh yes, there's one more thing. We need to get an um, actual gift, uh, GIF for our background. So let's see what we have here. Oh, that could be fun. No, let's not do that one. Let's do sure why not endless coats I like that so let's save it save this gif gif okay now we're gonna drag gif gif over to our project finish so we have our gif gif <laughs> it's a gif file it's a man with putting on endless coats okay. And I'm actually going to do, uh, let's do aspect fill for that. Let's go to our view controller. And it is super easy after you've set this up in order to add a GIF. And you can do this on any of your view controllers. So if you have multiple view controllers, um, you can do this to any of them. All you're going to do is type in BG or the name of whatever your image is, dot load GIF. And it's already a function that's been stored here. It's a function that's located in our gift to image file. And then you're simply just going to put the name of whatever it is. In my case, it's called gif gif. You don't have to say dot gif. That's all you got to do is just say gif gif or whatever the name of your gif is. Okay, just save that. I'm going to run it. Just wait for it to load here. And this does only work for GIFs, this file that we have here. So if you're trying to do an MP4, unfortunately not. it's not going to work. You can, um, you can make it into a GIF. There's a lot of websites out there. I may put a link underneath as well if you want to make something to a GIF. Um, but you can only do this with GIFs. So here we go. Here's our GIF of man putting on endless coats. And that's our screen. And that's how it's done. And if you want to put buttons and anything else on top of it, um, you can. This will just act as a regular background, just like it would be just an image. And so you can do whatever you want on top of that. Hope you enjoy that. Um, stay tuned for more videos. And if you have any questions, send me a message. I'm glad to help. Ooh.